It snowed. Dude. So hopefully we can get back up our driveway. I didn't plow it yet. It's like four inches or so. Look at that. Look at that. It's go time. Here. Really won this at an Easter egg hunt today. This is the second time we've been to this one, and the second time she won a special <laughs> thing because they put tickets inside the eggs. In certain, like, in certain eggs, and so go play basketball with that. You got three and candies. Wanted to go for days. Yeah, back to Target. So dad can get coffee. This way. She knows what way to go. We go get your milk. You can put it up at the counter. No for the dance. Look. Really. Look. She could wear this for the dance Thursday. Maybe. Really? Do you like this one? Come here. Purple. Or they have it in bright yellow. Do you like that one? Do you like this dress? Yes. Do you want it in yellow Look. or purple? Yellow. Which one? Yellow. Yellow. You like yellow? So these are the ones. I think it would be cute. She does like dresses. So. And if they're 20% off right now, and get a couple. Yeah. Alright, B. She's going in there. 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 She's going in She's probably gonna do that with these ones too. Maybe. Mm -hmm. Maybe not. We've made it. Snack time club. Snack time club. What did I Maybe she's naming him. That's that's possible. What about those four, Brayden? What do you know? Band aid. Band aid. Band aid. Band aid. Band aid. Are you naming them all, Brayden? We can never uh, skip the aisle ever. No. Mac and mac and cheese. Mac and mac and cheese. Mac and mac and cheese. It's always an adventure, I want to say, with Braley. 
You never know what we're gonna get, like as far as what she's gonna, what impulses are gonna, are gonna show up today. We think potentially naming. The naming the, the mannequins, yeah. Or, or even not naming them, but like accounting a vocal stem for each of them. You know what I mean? Yeah. She was vocal stemming for each one, and then she would move on. She almost did tip one of them over, but. She was a little too aggressive. She's a little aggressive with that mannequin. Not angry aggressive, just enthusiastic, I guess. Yeah, she, like, was, she was pushing like, hey, walk with me. That's what well, she usually was taps them, and I think it was just too hard. Yeah. She went a little too. She likes cool. also grabbing their hands. I, I think she's just interested in what they are. I wish we just knew what she was thinking when she was it, when she interacts with mannequins, like why why she does what she does. It's I so funny. Love to know. The one that was her size and girls, she stood there for a long time, like sizing up, like she wanted to fight or something. <laughs> she just she stopped at that one for a long, long time. Yeah, she did. Back to coloring. The snow hasn't gotten too terribly bad yet. I don't know if this winter storm has arrived yet. It's supposed to be a lot worse than it is right now. No, that's not rain. That's just melted snow. Do we have any uh, radar watchers here? I am an enthusiastic radar watcher on my weather app. Do you like weather apps? My favorite weather app is Weather Underground. Oh yeah. It has just begun. That is a lot of blue snow. The worst of it's yet to come. Looks like where that big green blob is where the worst of it's at. It's only supposed to get more intense as the day goes on. The winter storm literally just started an hour ago. Yes, meteorologist David, Davey. Meteorologist David talking about weather here. It's supposed to go from 10 a.m. this morning, which is Sunday, all the way to Tuesday 7 a.m. So it's gonna be a long period of snow. Maybe Braley won't have school on Monday. Maybe there'll be a snow day. One thing about working at home is I don't get snow days. Do you want mac and cheese? Yes or no? No. Do you want food? Yes or no? No. Do you want noodles and company? Yes or no? No. I don't believe you. Do you don't want noodles and company? Yes or no? Yes. That's what I thought. <laughs> uh, what do you want from Noodles and Company? Mac and cheese? Yeah. Or butter noodles? Or butter noodles? Butter noodles? Butter noodles or mac and cheese? Mac and cheese. Mac and cheese or butter noodles? Butter noodles. My theory is when she when she just picks the second one, she's like, yeah, either's fine type thing. Like there's not like a big one. Like you know how it is. Like sometimes like I could go for either. Sometimes there's like something that's going on. And you're like, yeah, I could. Uh, yes or no, that's fine. Either way. You take okay. care of it. I have a lot of those situations where I don't want to make the decision. You know, and decision fatigue is a real thing. Oh, tell me about it. Yeah. You make Stacey me make decisions <laughs> Stacey... all the time, and then I get all pissy and irritated. <laughs> Stacy makes me make me decisions all the time. Mommy. Yeah. Welcome to married life, where decisions. Decision fatigue is just real as an adult. We, we try to we try to push off decisions on each other, <laughs> especially the like food, and yeah, easy decisions to make. We're usually trying to push it off on each other. Food decisions, very hard to do, even it's like though it all should of be those so easy. memes that are like, I never realized when I grew up how much I would come to hate growing up and having to choose what to feed everybody every day. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Or it'd be like, I don't know if you guys saw, we shared a story that was really funny yesterday. What? Oh, the mac and cheese. The one. mac and cheese, it was like, my kid, when I make them, like a box of mac and cheese just like the craft or whatever they're just like this is it this is it compared to making them a nutritious like full rounded meal they're just the mac and cheese hits right every time yeah the craft mac and cheese specifically all right not too bad of a drive home today huh but today Braley, we are going to have to uh 
not go to the hockey game. There's a PWHL game today, but it's about an hour and a half drive into St. Paul. I'm just not 100% comfortable riding it, especially since the storm's only supposed to get worse throughout the day, and once the sun goes down, it's probably gonna get a lot worse for driving, so. We decided we're just gonna not go to the game today. It's really starting, it's really starting to come down out here. It's really starting, huh, B? Snow time. Look at all that snow on the car. Ding, ding, ding. Well, it got jammed in there, didn't it? <laughs> this is literally already the biggest storm of the year. It just got started two hours ago and it's supposed to go for two days. <laughs> I am a PSP, pro snow person. Yes, as the snow continues, uh, we're gonna turn today, snow day, into some baking. Bradley picked up these cookies at the store. She really wanted these cookies. Oatmeal chocolate chip cookies. She takes an opportunity, you know, like, oh, mom and dad aren't watching for a second. She runs in here and grabs this and opens it up. I'm like, yep, I know what she wants to do today. I have it all set up for her. Usually, I have her go and grab everything. Like, have her go through the drawers and grab like the bowl and the, the egg and the pans and stuff. But today, I figured we're gonna make it a nice directionless cookie experience. I mean, there will be some directions, but very minimal. And I'm just waiting for this butter to soften up a little bit more and we're gonna get started with some cookie making today. Cookie baking. If you have not seen any of Baking with Bee videos, I highly recommend you go and check those out because Braley baking is such a fun experience and it's really cool to see how baking brings out communication, it brings out direction following, it brings out interaction. Absolutely loves baking. Cookies. First put the egg in the bowl. Rinse your hands or wipe on your sweatshirt. That works too, I guess. Put in the cookie mix. Cookie mix. Yep. Right here. Cookie mix. Mm -hmm. And stir it all up. Making those cook cookies. Making the cook cookies. Your turn. Making the cookies. Making the, the cookies. Cookies, cookies, yum, yum. Cookies, cookies, yum, yum. Yeah, that butter wasn't really soft, was it? <laughs> cookies, cookies. Yum, yum. Just like that, cookies are done, kind of. I, I have a feeling that this is just gonna be two really big cookies because we are not cookie pros around here and we have really small pans. We'll be hopeful that we'll have two really good, really, really good cookies. As the snow continues and as the singing and stimming continue. As all that continues, I am going to end this video and we're gonna see you in the next one. Hopefully sooner than later. As you may notice, I've been making more lit videos lately. Hopefully that is a trend that continues. We'll see how busy the days get, how s snowy and exciting the days get. And we'll uh, see you 
see you in the next video. And yes, before I make this, like, end in this video, you'll see a picture of how the cookies turned out. I will put that at the very end. All right? After I say bye. So right now, goodbye. Peace.